May mga 20 pesos kayo or 10 pesos. I found a BCBG coat for 100 pesos. J Crew red coat for 100 pesos. 1,000. Sarado. What's up, lovers? It's me again, Lorene, and welcome back to my channel. Today, it's gonna be a pretty exciting day because we are doing another Ukay Challenge! Super namiss ko pumunta ng Ukay Ukay, to be honest. I haven't gone since the pandemic, and I actually don't know the price anymore. But, my budget for today, 1000 Unlike my previous Ukay Challenges before, na meron na akong theme, I actually did a designer Ukay Ukay Challenge, meron akong 200 pesos for three looks, I did a 500 peso ukay challenge. Medyo madami na. But for today, I don't have any specific theme in mind. I just know I'll be spending 1,000 pesos. Ko alam kung ilang damit yung mabibili ko or ilan looks yung magagawa ko. We'll find out at the end of this vlog. But for today's venue, we are headed to Quiapo. So, nagtanong ako sa Instagram stories kung saan yung mga okay na puntahan na ukay-ukay. And a lot of you guys mentioned Quiapo. And since I haven't been there, dun tayo pupunta today. Alam ko lang na Quiapo kami pupunta. And I know sa streets, meron din mga building doon na madaming pwedeng puntahan. So, I think, <laughs> ang goal lang namin is makapunta muna ng Quiapo near the church and then ask around kung saan yung best ukay-ukay. So, from there, do natin malalaman kung saan yung exact venue. Let's go! But, before we start, if you guys haven't subscribed yet, please do subscribe and hit that notification bell. Tara! Nagbaba na kami sa Quiapo. Kasama ko si Lu. Dito kami sa may SM nagbababa. Tapos may kalsada lang dito. So hahanapin namin yung Hidalgo ngayon. Kasi dun daw yung famous street. Pero dito pa lang, dami nang nagtitinda. Pero puro pagkain. Madaming mga 20 pesos, 50 pesos dito. Anyway, dadan tayo dito. Next stop ako sa childhood snack. May mga 20 pesos kayo or 10 pesos? Sa taas. Sa taas pa. Ayun pala. Doon tayo sa mura. <laughs> okay, so umabot na kami sa second floor. So, ang usually ginagawa ko sa ukay-ukay bago ako tumingin sa lahat. Tatanayin ko muna kung may sale pa sila. Kakalam ko. <laughs> At may mura below 100 or below 50. Thank you, ate. Para doon tayo kasi we're on a budget. Cute. Kailangan ko ata ng basket. Go! A BCBG coat for 100 pesos. Good job, Lorin. And a J Crew red coat. Pero mas bet ko yung BCBG. I also found this for 100 pesos. Sobrang cute. Look at the prints. Ang laki niya actually. Mga one fourth pa lang nakikita ko. So, I'm here at the men's section. Hanap ako. Ang key, tumingin ka lang ng tumingin. Sobrang dami magandang damit sa ukay-ukay. I got a couple of really nice bottoms and gonna try to look for designer ones now. So, tapos na kami sa second floor. Bababa na kami in a while. We are just choosing kung ano yung mga kukunin namin dito. Starting with... Tan -ta -da -dan. Okay, so itong pants short because it's really cute. Wala pa akong ganitong color. Ito, trench that I can wear when I go abroad. Ang cute. Or this. Shocks, ito pwede gamitin dito eh. May isa pa akong checkered. Ito munang tatlo. Yan, wag na. Shorts, yes. Super cute. Gusto ko sana ito kunin kasi garter. But may mga mancha sa likod. Cute! Both yes. Ito, yes also. Crystal. Cute romper. So, etong dalawa. For 10 pesos. Yes. 10 pesos. A 
Ata dito po ba ako magbibilang? Kung magkano? Oo, oh, oh, actually. Yung nagustuhan mo, ilagay mo dito. Okay, sige. Gusto ko lahat eh. <laughs> Pero, may budget ako ate. So, check muna natin. Doon tayo sa pinakamura. 100 ata. Ah, pulo. Ito, ang cute-cute talaga. Ito, oh, kunin ko na ito talaga. Oo, oh, ito rin ata. 50 lang, no? Ano ba? Tour. Ito, 10 pesos sa taas. So, syempre, sure tayo sa 10. Oo, <laughs> Nagdala tayo ng tote bag. 100, 100, 100, 100, 100, 100, 100, 100, 100, 100, 100, 100, 100, 100, 100, 100, 100, 100, 100, 100, 100, 100, Thank you so much, Ate. Candy na. Candy na tayo. So, I am back at Lao House. Super sakto. Uh, pinatawad ako ni Ate ng 5 pesos. Pero kasi, mura naman na talaga lahat. So, I got everything for 1,000 pesos. So, pagbaba mo ng Kiapo, madami talaga makikita sa street. Kasi kalsada pa lang, you already have people selling food, clothes. So, halo na siya. And ang daming mura. Like, may mga nakita akong prices for 10, 20 pesos. May mga iba, 3 for 100 pesos. But, lahat ng shinopping ko ngayon, saan, saan siya. So, nahanap ko na yung name. <laughs> We were able to ask. It really looks like a food shop. Like, mga nagtitinda nga ng How Flakes, Nougat. But, when you go inside, inside, it's really a legit ukay store with two floors. So anyway, I opted for Ansan kasi ang ganda ng quality ng clothes nila. And you also see a lot of really nice brands inside. Like I saw Zara, may H&M sila, may Urban Outfitters. May mga key pieces like BCBG, yung binili ko na Chriselle Lim. They have a lot of Ralph Lauren, Tommy Hilfiger. So ang dami magandang brands. But I opted to choose items that are really unique and hard to find. Ang dami ko nakita ang polos and tops na first time ko nakita yung print. So yun yung mga binili ko mo. Vintage pieces. As they call it. Baka ma-hurt na naman si Vin sa vintage. Pero ito talaga legit. Mukhang vintage na siya. Let us start with this cobalt blue top that I got for 20 pesos. Ito na yung pinakamurang nabili namin. So I thought it was 10 pesos but nagkamali lang daw. So this is 20. Super nice. And wait sa likod. You have this dramatic effect. And dami ko na isip na ways on how I can wear this one. And the next most affordable item that I got is this neon top. Shempre, hindi tayo kakala sa neon. I got this for 35 pesos. And na uso rin yung mga ganitong classic tops ngayon. I also got this dress for 100 pesos. Super ganda. So you can wear a tank top, long sleeves inside. Also very cute if naka socks ka and heels. Also love this effect. The bottom. Itong shorts, papa-alter ko talaga siya. But, I fell in love with the print. It's very 90s. Super loose niya for me. So, for sure, papalitan ko yung garter. And, I'm still contemplating if I want it shorter or not. Got this for 50 pesos. This one also is 50 pesos. Super chic. And I got a bunch of polos that I can wear in the city or at the beach. So I can wear it with a tank top, I can wear it with my shorts, with a bikini. So I got a bunch na solid colors, pero yung pagka pop of color niya, iba talaga. I usually see a lot of polos, of course, in the mall. But aside from the fact na 100 pesos each lang to, sobrang tingkad ng kulay niya. And honestly, quality is also super nice. So I got this red one. Next time I go to Hungry Homies, I'm gonna wear this. Got this top too. So, hindi siya polo. It's more of a suit. You have shoulder pads. And I really, really love the color of this one. And also the buttons. I'm very particular with buttons also when I buy something. Hindi siya yung usual buttons mo. One of my favorite pieces. Ang ganda ng quality. And ang ganda ng print. And ang ganda ng price. I got this for 100 pesos. Look at that. I mean, you can easily wear it in Manila also because the fabric is thin. It's not a thick jacket. You can wear it with a tank top and jeans and you'll still look super cool. Also got this polo for 50 pesos. Ito, super perfect for the beach kasi sobrang lambot ng tela niya. And I have a lot of orange swimsuits. So I'm definitely gonna bring this with me to my next beach trip. Last three items. Black and white polo. 
So I rarely see black and white polos na printed aside from like cow print or checkered or polka dots. This one is unique and I love the mix of the color with the print. Parang may solid black dito in this one. And Super cute ng shape ng sleeve niya here. Of course, I got this blazer also for 100 pesos. Super nice. Ganda ng quality. I know I have a polo na ganito, but I don't have a blazer with this print yet. So it's super nice, especially because it may pink na detail pa here. So cute. And the last one, which is like a personal favorite too. So, itong dalawa yung top two favorite ko. This one I got for a hundred pesos also. Super bigat niya. Super ganda ng print and color. I love violet, purple, lilac, lahat yan. Alam niyo na yan. Even yung sa wrist niya, the detail is so cute. So, may garter siya. You got really nice buttons as well. Very vintage. And it's a hoodie coat. So if you're traveling, you don't need to worry if it's gonna rain. Kasi nga, itong jacket na to, may hoodie na. And the best part is with pockets as well. So super perfect niya sa style ko. And yun lang, it's a little bit heavy because of the fabric. But perfect siya for fall and spring weather. And yeah, that's it! nag exceed ako ng 5 pesos, pero pinatawad ako ni ate. So pasok pa rin siya sa 1,000. So yes! Ito na yun. I'm super happy na nakaukay na ako ulit. For me, you can really find nice and unique pieces as long as you really go through all the racks. Like, as in, lahat ng racks, inisa-isa ko para mahanap ko talaga yung mga pieces na gusto ko. And for sure, kahit sa ukay pa yan, may mahanap kayo. Having said that, this is the end of my vlog. I hope you guys enjoyed another ukay vlog. I haven't had one in a while. So, sana nag-enjoy din kayo. And if bitin kayo dito, you can watch my previous ones. I do have a lot of other ukay challenge vlogs too. And if you guys have any suggestions in the future kung saan akong ukay pwede pumunta, whether it be for streetwear or designer clothes or whatever, basta if gusto nyo ma-visit ko rin yung mga ukay na yun, please leave a comment down below. But for now, I'll be saying goodbye. If you guys enjoyed, you know what to do. Please do not forget to leave some love, like, comment below, and most important be subscribed and hit that notification bell if you guys haven't yet for now. Bye guys, see you in my next one.